Hi Libra, thank you so much for clicking on my video. I'm Karma, this is Carmelite Readings. I'm sorry you can't see my face today. I'm feeling really sick and I didn't wanna be on camera, but I really wanted to get you guys your readings. So this is Libra's love reading. I have you guys right here. So this is Libra's love reading for July 21st through July 31st. So let's go ahead and get started, Spirit. All right, what do we got? Okay, we have the Eight of Cups. So there's been some sort of progress or transition in this connection, okay? Some sort of positive progress. You guys could be deciding to do this together. Ooh, okay, until Spirit throws us for a loop. So I have the Three of Pentacles in reverse and the King of Pentacles in reverse. <coughs> Somebody is interfering with this connection, okay? So maybe the progress that you're making, it is for the better in the long run, but there's some sort of interference. Somebody's butting their head in where it doesn't belong. Very controlling person, okay? I see some controlling energy here. Very stubborn, could be a little argumentative sometimes, okay? Let's see. Seven of Wands. So somebody's feeling like, this is a challenge. They're feeling very selective, needing to select who they're gonna have around, feeling like they need to be on defense mode. Their guard is up, Libra. Um, and they're, I think that that's why we have this transition um, card here. We have a transition card. Look, I was shuffling and a card flew on my lap and it's Virgo, Libra. We have Virgo's energy, but it's in reverse. So somebody really feels like something failed they're withdrawing from this connection here, okay? They're being very cold towards the connection. So Spirit, can we get some, some clarity here? Magician in reverse, there's a lack of something or you guys had to take a break. They're so focused on the lack in this connection. Libra, what is going on here? So these are in reverse. I'm definitely feeling, Libra, that something is needing to take a break or you guys have already decided on a break. What do we have here? Eight of swords in reverse. Somebody's very hurt. Somebody's very hurt in this connection, Libra, and they need time to heal. They need time to heal. Yeah, even the king of cups is in reverse. Somebody was very, they're feeling like somebody was very untrustworthy, untru maybe manipulative in this connection, and they're needing to heal from it, okay? But then this card just flew out. So this is the Ten of Cups, and this is promise of real love and abundance is coming. So let's get some clarification on that spirit. We're having some confusing cards here. Clarify this Ten of Cups. Is this what's coming? For my Libras? No, Spirit, not with 47 cards. <laughs> oh my gosh, I hope you guys are too. Wow. So clarity will be brought, a new beginning, okay, renewing, somebody knowing their value and your value. So whoever needs to go through this healing process, <coughs> they're going to come back. And I apologize for coughing. I, I, I am a little sick. I've coughed up somewhere. But they're going to be coming back. And they're going to be wanting to renew this because they're going to have learned and grew so much during this um, healing phase that they need to go through. And this is what they want to bring you. They want to bring you that abundance. And they want, they want that relationship, that connection with you. But there were some bad choices. See, we're getting... This is a lot of back and forth, Libra, wishy-washy. This is a soulmate connection, and both of you know it, but somebody was being irresponsible and making some bad choices, and it led to the, the split. It led to the ending of the connection, and I feel like it was, it was so this, and you need some clarity on that because we also have the, the world card. So it's like something ended, the cycle ended, there was a completion between this soulmate connection, but the love is still there. The love is still there, Libra. So let's see. Spirit, can we have some clarification? Love reading for Libra, July 21st through July 31st. 
Okay, so King of Wands and wow. So somebody was being very immature and very irresponsible, but they want this harmony and balanced relationship with you, Libra. They want this Ten of Pentacles with you, but they're having a difficult time. But I think that you guys are gonna get it because this is change and a new beginning, Libra. A new, yes, the birth of something new, the Empress. Okay. So hold on, another card just flew out. What is it? What is it? Oh, yes. <laughs> so, Libra, this is beautiful. So, I feel like there's been some confusion in this connection, okay? Which was causing it to be a little bit wishy washy and a little bit standoff. Could have been some self esteem issues and self-worth issues which is where we got this eight of swords and needing to heal ourselves okay but this is the beginning of something new okay new times renewal it's the birth of something new and it is very victorious we have the six of wands here very filled with with positive yes we have the three of cups so coming together really enjoying each other's company and your time with each other in this connection that's what I see coming for you guys this week. Let's see what else does spirit have to say for my Libras. Here we go. All right, Libras. This connection is connected to your life purpose. Okay, so that means that this connection, like we saw here with the Two of Cups, it is a soulmate connection, and you know that. You feel this person on a different level. And spirit is asking you to look past any disagreements that you guys have had and just come from a place of love know that we're all here um trying to learn it all yeah so don't carry everything with you in this relationship there is a second chance coming in this connection libra there is a second chance coming because i feel like something ended something ended wow something ended and it was painful it's a really painful ending okay and somebody was just not being sensitive to that, to, to what was happening in the connection. But it's all going to be beginning. It's all a new beginning. A lot of spiritual gifts and connections coming in for you, Libra. And I do think that this is a renewal. It is. Look at this. The lover's card, Libra. <coughs> this is Gemini's energy here, Libra. But know that you have this new beginning coming with, with this person. It's a renewal. It's a re and I apologize for that noise outside. But you guys are going to be making things right. There's a lot of things that need to be balanced and, and really coming forward together with that next level of commitment. There was some pain I see in the past. There was some pain in the past, but Spirit is really telling you, to let it go leave it in the past they want you to be able to enjoy this this is a true union know that you are being guided and that it's trustworthy you don't have to doubt that things are on the right path for you really connect to yourself ground yourself stay centered okay centered in your soul which is your heart chakra our soul lives in our heart okay perfect timing so this is Spirit's way of letting you know that what's happening for you right now is meant to happen. It's supposed to happen. And it is for this connection to blossom. So let's see. What else do we have for Libra love? I don't like this guy. What's the story? A lot of swords. So that could represent you. A lot of air air energy here so libra that's you aquarius okay gemini okay uh but i'm worried about these cards so i don't know if this was in the past but you could feel like somebody was toying with your emotions but they really want to reconcile so i think what's going to happen is there's going to be some talk about who was messing with somebody's emotions who was playing with somebody's emotions and they're going to come forward and want to reconcile and surrender that and kind of rebirth this relationship like i'm sorry that i was acting this way and being foolish okay and being foolish yep we have the queen of wands in reverse so queen of wands in reverse is very cold okay somebody's going to be very upset about it 
okay? Somebody's gonna be a little upset. Somebody could be cold to the renewal. That could be you, Libra, or the other person could kind of, if you are coming forward to apologize about something, Libra, the other person could kind of be like, well, wait a minute, you really hurt me here, okay? But we have Leo's energy. So this will be happening this week in the season of Leo. And what Spirit is saying is to remain calm. Stay, tame the beast, okay? Tame the beast. Stay within and be calm so that you guys can have the conversation you need to have to heal the Spirit. I need closing messages. Closing messages for my Libras on this love connection. July 21st through July 31st. Closing messages, okay? What do we have here? All right, some, this was a karmic cycle. Something is ending and something new is beginning, okay? Destiny, you could feel like somebody's taking you for a ride. Somebody was being lazy towards the connection. And unfortunately, Libra, I feel like even if you come forward, <coughs> somebody is going to stall the offer. Somebody's coming forward in this connection, Libra. Libra either you or the person that you're connected to, okay? And they're coming forward and you're going to stall the offer because you need time to think about it or they need time to think about it based on things that have happened in the past. So closing messages from spirit, closing messages from spirit, giving and receiving. Make sure that your balance is, you know, that you're giving just as much as you're receiving, okay? Giving just as much as you are receiving. And it's time to accept the situation for what it is. If it's you or somebody else, just allow yourself to be in the moment. If you need to think about something before making a decision, Spirit is saying to do that gratefully. Libra, this is your reading, July 21st through July 31st. Love reading. Thank you so much. Make sure you subscribe and like my video. And please come back soon for August readings. I love you guys so much and I appreciate all of your support. See you soon.